Hello lovelies. How are we? Leslie, not quite enough distance vlog. Possibly soon to be rain renamed as not quite enough week. Haven't decided yet. How are we all? Hope everyone's okay. Thank you for all the comments and thoughts and observations on last week's vlog and the podcast. Always lovely to hear from you and to hear your ideas. So thank you very much. Uh, How has the week gone here? Uh, Friday evening, I was out for a meal with some folks I know, which was very nice. Thai food. Oh, who doesn't love a Tom Yum? Mm. Um, at the weekend, uh, Sunday himself went away. He's back next Monday. And I had a Zoom call with some lovely friends. So hello, ladies. It was it was good to see them. Um, good to talk to them. Uh, Monday night drum practice. I left early because I had an early start Tuesday morning. Uh, I had to go about as far as I normally travel for ceremonies. You know, about the furthest I normally travel for to visit people. And uh, I'm not saying it felt remote, but the, when I was given the directions, the lady said, "Have you heard of what three words?" And they gave me the what three words location as well as the postcode. It's not as bad as it seems um, because it is in a, a rural area. The postcode covers a long area, you know, a big space. Whereas the what three words does pinpoint it very exactly. But it still gave me a bit of a, a thought. And I thought, where have I got to go to? Do I need to pack hiking boots and a torch and a flare and yeah, some kind of navigation system beyond what I already have but it was all fine it was all fine and then this morning uh, today being Wednesday just had a chat with my lovely friend who lives in France uh, we used to work together and uh, yeah always lots of laughter when we speak so that's all good so yes it's been a sort of catching up with people I spoke to Mandy yesterday it's been a catching up with people sort of week so, uh, so yeah that's all good Craft-wise, as I had finished the shawl for Jude and the ranunculus sweater, I'm on newish projects, so I've gone back to, halfway through a row, the Pearl Soho cardigan that I'd started. And because it's a nice large gauge, I'm on 7mm needles. Um, the pattern originally said 10, but I got, a, uh, got gauge on 7. This will be a fairly quick make, I'm hoping, so... So that will be a useful item with a bit of luck. Weather-wise, we've had sun and rain. Uh, it's been quite cold, hence cardigans and dog grumpy. But um, we've got sunshine today, so that's nice and bright. Uh, I tried to light a fire yesterday evening and it, it really didn't work well. Uh, so I've cleared out the grate this morning. I'll have another go this evening, I think. Um, it's, it's, I'm resisting putting the central heating on. We've got lots of wood there. It's mainly, you know, it's just me and the dog in the house and we're in one room pretty much. So we can light the fire in that room this evening. So That's the plan. So I hope you're all having a good week. I um, hope there's good stuff going on and kind weather and that you're keeping well and I will hopefully catch up with you later in the week. Cheers. Hello lovelies. It's Thursday. I've had one of those days where I can't really concentrate on anything. Very sort of butterfly brain today. Um, I feel like I want to cast on a hundred things and not do any work. Not that different to a regular day but stronger. So. <laughs> So I hope you're all doing okay. Um, very chilly here, so yesterday I lit a fire. It looks like it's a blazing fire, but um, it didn't stay blazing. I, I'll have another go this evening. All fine, all fine. Um, Madam is missing her daddy. Himself is away this week. Uh, he's currently in Scotland. He was in the north of England. He's now in Scotland watching golf. So he's doing that. And yeah, just plodding on, avoiding the rain. Uh, but we have had some sunshine. Madam was out in the sun earlier, 
making the most of it while it was here. It's been a very quiet week, so I haven't got a lot to say this week, I'm afraid, so I will keep this brief, but I hope you're all well. I hope everyone's safe. Um, if you're in Florida particularly, where my nephew is. As far as we know, he's okay. <laughs> but yeah, I hope everyone's safe. I hope you're able to avoid the extremes of weather, whatever form they're taking for you. And that you're keeping well and finding moments of joy in your day. So thanks so much for being here. And I will see you again next week. Cheers. Bye-bye.